Hello everyone. So today I'm fighting hard. I have currently a migraine, which is why my eyes are droopy and it's right here. Uh, <laughs> I've had such a horrible day. Like I thought like Monday and Tuesday were horrible. Ain't got nothing on today. Today is a lot worse, but even so, I am still doing what I need to do because I just, I can't let the enemy stop me from doing what God wants me to do. I'm going to push through it. No matter the pain, let me tell you, I have pushed through the pain of today. I've gotten so much done, and I'm so thankful that even though I was slow to get it done, I'm getting it done. I still have a bit to go, but then I'll be done. Uh, I can't do uh, part two just yet because... I have to look at a bright screen to do it and with my headache I can't handle the light of the screen right now um, not only that reading hurts because I have to focus on the words so I just I can't I'm using all the energy I have for what God has me doing right now and then I'm going to bed if you want to know what I'm doing, currently, my lovely, wonderful, servant-hearted husband is making me our protocol soup. So when we get sick in this house, first thing we do is we pray. We lay on hands and we pray. If that doesn't help work within like a certain amount of time, like let's say 6-12 hours, okay? which it's been 12 hours now because I've been up since 4. If it doesn't work within that amount of time, then we go to plan B, which is flush the blood system of any toxins, anything. And how we do that is, is onion, garlic, and ginger in Either broth or water, doesn't matter. I use I usually use broth. Himalayan pink salt and pepper, black pepper. You flush your system this way. You drink it, doesn't matter for me because um I don't I don't eat solids. I usually just have a whole bowl full. But if you're like eating solids, um I would recommend a cup, like a mug full every like three times a day when you're sick also interchangeably depending on your symptoms and how bad you, it feels or achy valerian is really good for pain so i get valerian tinctures and elderberry syrup obviously because it has a lot of vitamin c and d in it um orange juice strawberries blueberries uh, if you're on a budget these are good things to have blend sift for me blend sift that's what I do so with strawberries and blueberries I put it in orange juice strawberries and the blueberries blend it then I sift it another thing we do is teas like Ginger tea, green tea, peppermint for sore throat. Uh, for cough, if you want to do something natural and you don't want like cough medicine from the pharmacy, believe it or not, pickled juice and or honey. Raw honey, not like store-bought pasteurized honey, but unpasteurized honey, raw very good for sore throat and cough.
Last time I was sick, we did this. Well, we just flushed me from with the onion, garlic, and ginger. Um, and then I was fine. So um, hopefully that works again. Uh, that's why we're doing it. It usually works along with prayer. Prayer and that protocol usually is all I need when I'm sick and then I'm done. It's, it's okay. With the migraine, though, I have, um, I've had to take valerian because of my migraine and i'm going to be laying down soon because it's getting pretty pretty bad to the point where i'm going to need a dark room cold cloth and just rest so i'm going to try to finish up what i'm doing as quickly as i can so i can just lay down just pray for us pure bloods man them witches are really speaking spells. If you don't know, Proverbs 18.21 says that the power of life and death is in the tongue. That means that you can either, spike, either speak life over someone with your tongue or speak death over someone with your tongue. And if you haven't noticed, our world leaders are literally speaking death over pure bloods right now. So... We need to pray fervently. Sorry, guys. My head. My eyes getting sticky, too, on this side for some reason. Fervently for pure bloods right now because we are experiencing heavy attack. And we need all the help we can get right now. I love you all, and I'm really, really sorry that this happened to me. I do have three autoimmune diseases, though. <laughs> so, I just don't usually get this sick. Because, you know, prayer usually is all I need. But I guess I need a little bit more help this time. Lord is working, I can see that. And I trust in Him and Psalms 91. So, that's all I need. God, protocol, rest, and prayers. Love you all. God bless you all. And I will see you in a couple of days when I'm feeling a little bit better. Love you all. Later for now.